Hi, I'm Eric. Installing a hitch on your Chevy Trax can take you to some really fun places like camping or bike riding. You can even tow a U-Haul trailer in almost anywhere in North America. Let's break this hitch install down. You'll need the tools seen here to complete this installation. First things first, we have to lower the exhaust to make the installation easier. I'm going to start by strapping the exhaust so when we lower it, it doesn't damage the exhaust. Next, we're going to remove these two exhaust hangers using our exhaust pliers and a little bit of soapy water. The next step is to drop our supplied bolt through the frame using our fish wire tank technique. Let's show you how it's done. We noticed that the brake line is in the way for us to slide our bolt into the frame, so we're just gonna move it out of the way just a tad bit by using a pry bar. We start by fishing the fish wire through the frame of the hole that we're dropping the bolt in. It comes out this exit hole that we move this brake line out of the way. Now we slide the bolt through the spacer and screw it onto the fish wire. Now when we pull it through, we put the spacer through first. Then the bolt, and we pull it through the hole. We leave the fish wire on the bolt for guidance for when we put the hitch back in place. Now we're gonna repeat that process on the other side. It's time to put the hitch in place. I'm gonna use a U-Haul exclusive jack to install it. If you don't have one of those, I advise you to get a second pair of hands because the hitch is heavy. I'm going to put the fish wire through the hole so it helps guide the bolt through the hole. I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. Now it's time to use our hardware. We're going to use this bolt and the conical washer. When you install these, you want to install them with the conical tooth facing the hitch. Two on this side, two on that side. I'm going to tighten these snug using a 19 millimeter wrench. And now we're going to repeat that same process on the other side. Now it's time to take the fish wire off the bottom bolt. I usually just yank them off. It's quicker and easier that way. Now we're gonna put this nut on here, which is a self-locking nut. We're just gonna hand tighten this for now. And we'll repeat on the other side. Now I'm gonna tighten everything down to specs. You can find those in the description below. Now for these side bolts, I'm using a 19 millimeter. For these low bolts, we're going to use the 18 millimeter. Now we're going to reinstall the exhaust. It helps to spray a little bit of soapy water and slide it on. Now we're going to remove our safety strap. Now that our hitch is installed, we brought our vehicle down to level ground so we can show you some important measurements. This is an inch and a quarter receiver. From the pinhole to the edge of the bumper, it's six inches. From the ground to the top of the inside of the receiver, it's 10 and 3 quarters inches. This will help you determine the length, rise, and drop of your hitch accessories, such as a bike rack or cargo carrier. If you have any questions about the product or if you'd like to schedule an installation with a U-Haul hitch professional, visit your local U-Haul store or visit us online at uhaulhitches.com.